Hi, my name is Jason Doby. I'm the executive chef here at Z's Grill at Niagara on the Lake, and we're going to show you a few recipes today that we do in the kitchen here at Z's. So next, I'm going to show you how we make the soba noodle miso pasta, which is one of the vegan vegetarian options on the menu. Um, so the ingredients we have here is some sliced garlic, some sliced daikon radish, bok choy, soba noodles, which have already been blanched, uh, mushrooms, which are already pre-cooked, cauliflower, which has been roasted. We have some toasted cashews, some fresh cilantro for garnish. Um, then we have our pickled ginger, and our miso sauce, which we made earlier. So we're gonna start with a frying pan here on like a medium heat. It's a little bit of canola oil in there. And we're gonna start by adding our garlic. About two cloves sliced. I just wanna get a tiny bit of color on that. That's good, now we're gonna add our bok choy. Quick little tossy toss. Tiny pinch of salt. You don't want to add too much salt because the miso sauce itself is already quite salty. So a quick saute on the bok choy. Then we go in our mushrooms, cauliflower, uh, daikon. Oops. I'm just going to add just a splash of water to that. Just to steam it up. So next we're going to add our blanched soba noodles. I just put it right in. Our miso sauce. Depending on how saucy you want it. I just added about a cup right there. I'm just going to give that a toss until it's all warmed through. So our pasta is done. We're just going to plate it up here. So I just kind of twist up the, the pasta in the bowl, then pour the vegetables over top. Then we have our homemade sweet chili sauce that we make here as well. A little bit of heat, just put a little bit of that around. Some toasted cashew nuts. And then we'll just top it with a little bit of our pickled ginger and some fresh cilantro. And that's it. 